We want to know what foreign people think about Spain and we will discover it by asking them some questions and showing them some pictures about some famous Spanish celebrities. When you first came here, did you know a lot of things about Spain? Not a lot. I'd heard of stereotypes. We, in England we hear about the sun, the sea, the sand and the holidays in Spain. But I was very surprised to see how different uh, Lleida and Catalonia is and how different Spain is in its different regions. Spain is, is a great country. It's a great country. Um, there are toros and, uh, and paella and sangria. San sangria, really good sangria. Yeah. Bom, a única coisa que eu sabia era que eu, tava na, eu ia vir para a região da Catalunha e que as pessoas falavam catalão e falavam espanhol, só que eu pensei que falassem mais espanhol. Eu sempre pensei nas touradas, nas flamencas. Uh, well, it's a country by the Mediterranean Sea and, you know, people eat paella and, like, um, tortilla de patata, and I don't know, like, there's sun every day. I was surprised at the difference between um, different people in different parts of Spain when I arrived. I didn't realize there was so much cultural diversity and different languages in different regions. I thought everybody was Spanish and did Sevillanas and drank a lot. But I found out that no, it's different in different regions of the country. Spanish politics, well, if it wasn't for the last few months, I wouldn't have known anything about Spanish politics. It's just that the last few months maybe is the only time when it actually draws you in. So even if you're a person that doesn't care about politics, it's like you have to have an opinion of your own. So what do I know about Spanish politics in the last few months? Well, it's just the big fight between Catalonia and Madrid and all of this. I think politicians in, in all countries are very similar. They, they all are very similar to the UK. They want to do their own thing. Some try to do their, their best with the public, and sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't. Well, I think basically they're all stupid because there's a sort of serious political situation, and everything they do it just makes it worse. Nobody's providing a solution for anything. Bom, eu não sei muito, quando eu estava me preparando para vir aqui, a única coisa que eu sabia que estava um conflito político, que a Catalunha já vinha há muito tempo pedindo independência. Uh, like, some of the Catalonian politicians are like in jail, but I don't know, there's like, kind of, a lot of stuff going on that I don't really know about, to be honest. What do you think about Spaniards? About Spaniards? Um, I think they are very wild in a very positive way in the sense that it's not like the Nordic countries uh, being calm and educated and very polite towards everything although of course they are but it's in a very kind of wild way which I think is very attractive. Yeah I, I really like them they're very friendly very outgoing I was really again surprised by how you all go out and socialize every weekend and, and family is very important to you. As people in general are very beautiful, but they are not as amable as the Brazilians, they are more frios. Like, people are very happy all the time, I don't know, they are like, it seems like it's, they are partying like all the time. What shocked you the most when you first came to Spain? Uh, I think everything a little bit, the food, the language, the temperature, especially in Lleida. It was very, very hot because I arrived in September. And compared to Manchester, it was hot. Again, it was different. I, I heard of the stereotypes of, you know, just the parties and, and, uh, and people going on holiday. But I was surprised how rich the culture is here, how complicated it is. It's really impressed, really impressive. Okay, the first thing that shocked me the most, is that positive or negative for both? Okay, the first thing that shocked me positively, I think it's like how open is this city about gay culture? And I think one of the things that I stayed for was because I enjoy seeing people that love each other like holding hands and being quite open about it in public. And I think that all the places in the world should be like that, so that's one of the things. Bom, acho que foi o short das meninas daqui. É muito curto porque no Brasil a gente sempre teve uma visão da da Europa como um país mais mais fechado, mais frio, com mais 
sei lá, de certa forma, mais recatado. So one of these people is a politician. Which one do you think it is? No idea, like this one. Mm. I don't I don't know. Uh, I think this one right here, like he's more like serious and I think he, he's the politician, yeah. I don't know, but I believe it is. <laughs> I think I've seen this person before. Do you know who are them? Uh, yeah, yeah, actors from... Uh, I've seen Pirates of the Caribbean, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, Javier Bardem and Penelope Cruz, yeah. No idea. <laughs> no. Two of these people are DJs. Two, two of think? them? Yes. Who do you think is not a DJ? Uh, this this guy is not a DJ. He, he cannot be a DJ. Maybe the guy in the middle. I have no idea. This one, I have no idea. Uh, maybe this one. Do you know any of these girls? One is an actress. Who do you think? Uh, yeah, yeah, Elsa Pataki. This one, yeah. Good actress. Yeah. That one. This one also is in some kind of TV shows or something like that, and the other ones I have no idea. I believe this one. Yeah, yeah, he's a football player from from Barcelona, from Barcelona, yeah? Yeah, he's Piqué from uh, Bar Barça, Barça. Yes, the famous Piqué. <laughs> no idea, but looks very Catalan. 